hello welcome back to my channel so i've been seeing a lot of people messaging me that i should do a video on how to scout store owner he may use it to cause something so for those of you that do not know Sabdi Girl, Sabdi Girl is a powerful tool for generating email list of store owners. Uh, regardless of the service you are offering, it's also used to uh, generate email list for your buyer. Maybe you want to do email marketing for your buyer and you need to be the subscriber email list then. We can use this Sabdi Girl tool so it's serving multiple purposes. So online match out juniors that already people can scout one store owner but they, uh, it's really annoying. So that's the reason why I love this um, Sabdi Girl so much because if I extract some images, if you try it, it will extract another image for you because uh, it actually work across many platforms. So don't forget to like and subscribe to this video. It won't cost you one minute to like and subscribe to this video. What are you waiting for? Press the button. So to get started, you just have to go to your browser and go to this uh, icon extension. Then click on manage extension. Then you can just click on this developer mode. Then after that, you can just click on developer mode. Then come to this load on pack and click on load on pack. Then after that, you can just choose a subdiga file and install it to your computer. So I will go ahead and select the subdiga file. Then after selecting the folder, you can see it is installed. Then you can just come to back to this icon and click on pen then after you have pinned it then you can just go and search for programmable search engine so that's where you can get your URL that you want to scout so you can just search for programmable search engine as you can see that is then just click on it after click on it this first page then just click on this first page so after that you can just click on get started then after click on get started uh, it will ask you to add another one that you want to use as you can see this all the uh, the one that I've already extracted before, so I will just click on add. After clicking on add, you can just name your search engine, you can just name your number one, number two, number three, regardless of any name that you want to name it. So I will just go ahead and name it number three. So after you name it number three, if you want to specify a page that you want uh, this URL to come from, you can just specify it. But for me, I will just click on search the entire web. So if for you, if you want maybe from Facebook, you can just type www.facebook.com maybe from google w. so just regardless of any one that you want to use so you can just click on it and use it so you can just click on this i'm not a report and verify your capture so after verifying your capture then you can just click on next so let's verify our capture first so after verifying your capture just click on create then after create then click on this customize button and after clicking on this customize button i can just copy this public url and after copying then just go to this icon and just paste it right here then after pasting it then this is your site footprint this is where uh, you can actually put in your keyword so as for me i want shopify store owner or uh, image so i will just go ahead and type and type shopify store owner image shopify store owners For this partner, you can just put at gmail.com any image that you want. So as for me, I will like at gmail.com, at yahoo.com, and at outlook.com. Then after that, you can select the location. Maybe you want United States, United Kingdom, Canada, any country that you want. But as for me, I will just go ahead and type United States. Just also choose maybe uh, Canada or Sweden. But let's just choose just uh, two location for this video. So after that, you can just click on start. Notes you can add as much as possible keywords right here. So I will just go and click on start. As you can see, it go to various sites, various platform, and start to extract store owner emails for me. As you can see, it's generating. You can see it's collected seems it's emails. So it started to many emails as soon as possible. So for you to generate more emails, it depends on how much your keyword is. 
if your keyword have so uh, much it will generate good email for you and for this pattern also you can put uh, many emails there as, as long as you want so you can just verify this capture then after that it will start to extract it for you so after that you can just uh, open a new tab and just search for a uh, new part to email verify because that's where you verify your email because at times uh, some if email may be in the sub that that just extracted to you so you don't have to search for this new part to email verify to just extract uh, those valid email and you will just uh, neglect those uh, invalid email just click on this new part to then just after, after clicking on this first page then you can just log in Okay, you can see I've already logged in because I've already have account with that before. But if you don't have account, you can just go ahead and sign up for the account. So let's go back to our subject here. And you can see it's still generating more emails. For the sake of this video, I will just like to stop it now and just click on that note. Note it will generate as much as you want, but for the sake of the video, we let you stop for now. So after clicking on stop, you can just click on download. So after you download it, you can just click on this uh, bulk email verifier, this new part two. Then after that, you can just click on verify email. Then after that, you can just choose a file that you want to verify, which is the subject file that you just extracted. So after clicking, then you can just select the subject file and select it. So after you have selected it, you just click on this validate button. After that, it will validate our email list. You can see our list is increased for processing. So after some time, it will be completed and then you can just copy it and send your address message to them and uh, offer them anything you want to offer. Then, uh, for along waiting for this thing you can just open a new tab and go to your gmail and after going to your gmail you can just compose a message for me i've already composed the address message that i want to send to them so as for you you can just compose your address message uh, if you are not unsure of what you send to them you can just use it to like chat gpt or publicity to uh, give you some ideas or hint to uh, create a outreach message and make sure that your outreach message are high comforting because if your outreach message is not uh, eyes catching they won't reply to your message and make sure that you are professional in service you want to offer to them then we can just click on this compose message then i will just paste in my subject line i've already pp and other that you can just paste in your message so you can see this is my message guys to now i'm kind of you come out close to your list as right as it just at least make sure you message, uh, mention the complaint that you are from you can see right as it just at least i took a look at your store and i must say the quality and effort you have invested you must compare them with the effort they have already invested in their store so that they will be so happy and excited to read more so i see great potential i have some exclusive strategy that will significantly uh, boost your sales and online feasibility make sure that you tell them what you actually want to reach out to them for what is meant to you reach out to them so you can just tell them so this idea are designed to deliver a strong how buy that's return on investment and make a great difference of your business so i would love to help tackle any challenges we are currently facing and discuss how my service can support your growth this offer is limited make sure that you let them know that your offer is limited that not just work in there that we want to offer them a professional service and it's time limited so you can say that so i encourage to act fast so make sure that you have a, um, uh, a word that can even maybe uh, make them to actually act fast and convert them so you can just select us soon then you can just put your then best regard kind of a common grocery like this right just look at that service then after that we can just go back to that our new party to see if our uh, email have been uh, verified so let's you can just go to this list and click on uh, result so as you can see it is completed you can see oh uh, actually there is no any spam email there's no any file email that's why i love this subject here because uh, the email that we generate for you is most of them are valid email because you can just click on this valid email and download your 
Fadi DM. Navada that you can just go to your uh, Fadi DM, then you can just copy them, maybe 10, 10 or anyone that you like. So as for me, I will just like to scout to maybe copy like 10, 10 or 20, 20. So make sure that you don't copy uh, too much because they can actually suspend or block your Gmail account or whatever email that you are using to scout them. So as for me, I would just like to copy 21st and come back and send them the address message. So make sure that you don't paste, you don't send it to this uh, to don't send it to this place because if you actually paste in your uh, email here, they will actually see the remaining people you sent the uh, the, uh, the address message to. So make sure you just click on this BCC. After clicking on this BCC, then you can just paste in your email list. You can see, then you can just send this to them. So that's how you can actually use Sabdika to uh, scout and generate a uh, buyer's email list. So after that, you can just click on Compose again and paste in your subject line and your address message and send it to them. So as you can see, I can just go back and copy the remaining emails. Note that you can actually generate as much email as you want. You can generate as much as you want. But for the sake of this video, so that it won't be too long, that's why I just decided to stop there. You can just click here and click on this PCC so that you see the the remaining emails that you paste them. And one thing is that make sure that you actually put your email here, maybe another email that you have so that to make sure that the message that you are reaching out to them um, is received to inbox not spam because at times this uh, so message uh, received to spam so just for you to be sure where your message is make sure that you just paste in your email address here so that when you send then you can just go to your second email address and check if the uh, email is in inbox or spam folder so you can just click on send and just send a message then so after so during this maybe they don't reply maybe you can just send a follow-up message to them and tell them that you are following up the past message that you actually sent to them so that's how you can actually use subject to scout them and scout as multiple as you want so you can also use it to generate a store owner uh, it may, maybe they want to run in a campaign and they need email list so it depends on the um, site footprint that's also keyword that you use you can just click on maybe you want to run in a campaign for shoe stock you can just click on shoe lovers you can just click on shoe lovers and it will generate email list of people that are interested in buying shoe or shoe buyers or all those kind of keyword any keyword that you know that can bring an uh, email list of a buyer that can actually purchase your buyer's uh, products. So if you find the video helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe to this video so that other people can also see the video helpful. So thank you, have a nice day.